have all the kind of ants and those kind of ants are not herbivores, are carnivores. Okay, carnivores are the animals can eat other um, animals like uh, insects, like mammals, and we have uh, a very uh, important example in army ants. Okay. Army ants can eat from cucurash, uh, all the kind of ants, until a little mammals, like rats. Wow. Yeah, from the forest. I s <laughs> so what we're saying is that the army ants are have some body parts that you'll mm -hmm. tell us a little bit later that allows them to feed on other animals, mm -hmm. to eat on other in insects, and actually we're mm -hmm. going to have for them at the end a really fun tape that I think they, they will enjoy. It. Uh, and, and imagine uh, in these colonies of army ants we can find find until 20 million individuals wow. living together. Yeah, it's very different than a uh, leaf cutter ants. Okay, we can see in a, yes. in a video. Those Going. are the army ants, you will see. Those animals uh, travel through the forest very fast, six kilometers per hour, very fast, and they are carrying brood from uh, other colonies because they are invaders. They can go to the nest of wasps, nests of other kind of ants, and take puppies, take larvae and eggs. And there yeah, we have we, a soldier, we can see right? A soldier. Yeah, they can carry the brood from all the colonies. Look at the mandibles. Very important for us is you need to see the adaptation of the mandibles. It's very important to eat, very important to fight. It's something important of this animal, this army ants, different in difference of leaf cutter meanwhile leaf cutter doing a nest in soil these army ants haven't nest they, they live together it. and in in that reason they can uh, build an, a wall with his body and in the center we can find the queen with brood with um, uh, nurseries uh, the temperature is very important in the center, it's very hot. Okay. They can do this structure called biwak to, to protect the queen and, and keep in an important hot temperature. So what they do is... Oh, can you hear that? Can you hear the sound? I think it's a toucan. Calling. Mm. So um, I think is that probably a male yeah, calling probably male. for a female. Yeah. Important, Anna. Males has a uh, very nice vocal sounds to yeah, to attract females or for to fight for territory. Probably this animal can, can, can say, in, "Oh, this is my territory. I'm singing this this kind of note." That's right. Mm -hmm. so, and it's very so if you note. if you get a chance and you're very quiet. Mm -hmm. And something, something important in the food web is a, a birds, bir, birds mm -hmm, can eat uh, from uh, ants. They feed they ants. ants, and the contribution of, of birds in the, in the tropical rainforest okay. is very important in the food web. Okay. Because yes. they eat, they huh? keep the population of ants. We can, we can see and we can find all the other groups. The group can eat meat, and the groups can eat uh, plants. Plants. Uh -huh. We can find one group can eat both. Oh, yeah. So that they eat plants that are the mm -hmm. producers, and they can eat the meat. So they are they eat the carnivores exactly. too. Exactly. Wow. And the nano of of those animals can eat the meat and and leaf are called omnivores. 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 Okay, yeah, exactly. great. And we can find in this uh, um, term uh, bullet ants. Oh, so we we have something that you brought us exactly. about bullet ants. Okay, the bullet ants are the most big, the, the biggest the ant of the of the tropics. Is one inch large. We can see it's very primitive, and they can eat from the canopy uh, flowers when the flowers when the um, 
when the when no more flowers in the trees, uh, they uh, obtain the fruit source from insects, from grasshoppers and other animals. Yeah, very important. So, so what's happening is that the the bullet ants, or many times here, and I know that you told me that it's not correct, but a paraponerus is called. Ant. But the bullet mm -hmm. ants are the largest one, mm -hmm. and they can eat plants and they can eat also mm -hmm. other animals. And Specific that's why they're called mm -hmm. the omnivores. Specifically flowers. The flowers has a structure of plants and in, inside of the, these flowers, we can find an, uh, liquids. Nectar. Mm -hmm. Nectar, and they can eat this one. Okay, something important. Army ants, leaf cutter ants, and bullet ants need the most important food source in this case is water. Oh, water we is forgot very about important. water. Ants and owls can drink right. water. We, we can't need live water. without water, mm -hmm. right? We would, we can stay a few days mm -hmm. without eating, but exactly. we cannot stay a few days without drinking. Mm -hmm. So I guess the same thing happens with the ants. Yeah, the the left cutter ants, uh, the sorry, the the bullet ants. Uh, obtain the water from the nectar and obtain the water from several, several uh, liquid structure from insects too. Okay. Mm -hmm. Great. And they can eat water from accumulated when rains coming uh, from 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 flowers. Mm -hmm.